Sean Combs arrested in Manhattan after grand jury indictment. The music mogul has been under mounting scrutiny. These freaking damn things, man. Damn windows and stuff. Get out. The music mogul has been under mounting scrutiny since 2023 lawsuit by former girlfriend Cassie accused him of sex trafficking and years of abuse. Everybody knows that. Combs representatives called him an innocent man. Sean Combs, the music mogul, mogul whose career has been upended by sexual assault lawsuits and a federal investigation, was arrested at Manhattan Hotel on Monday evening after a grand jury indicted him. The, indict- and the indictment is sealed and the charges were not announced, but Mark Agnafilo, a lawyer of Mr. Combs, said he believed he was being charged with racketeering and sex trafficking. So they charged them with sex trafficking and racketeering. <clears throat> Bro, keep He's- throwing them dead bodies. Yeah. A <laughs> statement from Mr. Combs legal team said they were disappointed with the decision to prosecute him and noted that he had been cooperative with their with the investigation and had voluntarily relocated to new york last week in anticipation of these charges so he moved to new york just because he already knew that they was gonna probably lock him up for something you know what he did that's why he moved yeah Sean Combs, music icon, self-made entrepreneur. Yeah, we know all this. Uh, And working to uplift the community. The statement said, he is an imperfect person, but he is not a criminal. Yeah, right. (laughs) It's for who's telling the story. He's not a criminal. You you kidding me, man? Yeah, it'd be documented to be a criminal. Damian Williams, the U.S. attorney for the Southern District of New York, said in a statement posted on social media late Monday that we expect to move to unseal the indictment in the morning and we'll have more to say at that time. Mr. Agnafilo said Mr. Combs had been arrested by officers with Homeland Security investigations at about 8.30 p.m. at the hotel where he was staying, the Park the Park Hyatt. New York on 57th Street. He is expected, well, it is expected he will be held overnight, then arraigned on Tuesday. Also, they they really they really arrested him, like for real, for real, like on some regular person kind of arrest arresting because it's like it's not like they 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 have him go to court. And then you know they do the indictment stuff, but then he still could get, go back to court and stuff, but still can leave and not be you know in their custody. But they actually have them have him in their custody. That's crazy. <laughs> it's over for your daddy. You could probably throw one last party. They are making him go through it like a regular person. Well, of course, because they probably gonna have him missing soon. So you already know. Whatever he say, it ain't going to matter no more. He took too long. Yeah. You should have dropped it down, Betty. The arrest of Mr. Combs, 54, makes him the highest profile figure in the music world to face criminal charges for sexual misconduct since R. Kelly. We knew Jeez. that. You already know. That's why they, they want you to focus on the Super Bowl argument. Oh, R. <laughs> Kelly, R. Kelly got 30 years? I didn't know that. Yeah, he got thirty jump offs. Wow, I didn't know that. I thought I, I thought he was gonna. I thought he had like fifteen, twenty. No, I didn't know he, he had 30. thirty. Yep. Yeah, R. Kelly's done. He's gone, bro. He's done. He gonna be super old when he gets out. The only the only the old joints are gonna know him. Only Imagine Diddy. Diddy's fifty four. You had twenty five to thirty years on Diddy's that. Dead. Yeah. Diddy's gone. The moment Diddy go in, he's gone. He's he done. Is, he's done. They're gonna have to protect Diddy because they're gonna body him the moment he go in jail. They basically talking about the same thing over and over again. You know, he sold the suit with Cassie. You know, paying her off, but that's still <coughs> that's good. why. That's why he never went to jail because he paid Cassie off, so she yep. couldn't press charges on none of that stuff. You could have watched him field goal her all through the street. They couldn't do nothing. She took the money. That's yeah, why it took, she somebody, goes. it took other people to come out and say something because she took the bread already. 
So her case would have broke the mail, but I think her husband and, gave gave the FBI the, the information anyway, though. And the video, that video in the hotel where he, uh, and you don't find that's ironic that in the hotel, in that other hotel, he beat her, beat her up and abused her and stuff, and they put that video out, and now they arrest him in the hotel, too? The funny thing is that nobody held that hotel for none of that. That that's another thing too. People was like riffing and ranting, and, and I understand like why the the hotel covered it up. Why the hotel didn't you do know, nothing? You know why they covered it up? It was dirty. He probably gave them. People yeah, he paid them off. Party. Yeah, they probably went to his party. Everybody yeah. forgot about that day. Yeah, he paid them off. Yeah, too. That's why none of that ever came out to life. And they they going in on this article saying everything from like the value and what the feds and all the rating and stuff that they did. Oh, you know how many you know how many artists is about to get paid. So if he's getting charged with racketeering and and uh and uh human trafficking, yeah, he he he's gonna get twenty and better. Bro, human trafficking, bro. I. I Bro, I, I, you're not making it, bro. It was nice knowing you, Diddy. Make sure you throw your last party. Because gonna... there's something they're not telling us, bro. It's not that like that human trafficking and racketeering has nothing to do with Cassie, and they're not saying in the article what it is exactly that he's being like, you know, charged for this racketeering and human traffic. Who he tra- who did he human traffic? That's what I want to know. They said them kids they had they they had video of him with little like with, with girls and shit. And now he, imagine he, they have the 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 Bieber stuff too that people were assuming. Listen, bro. Bieber knows what happened. Bieber ain't never been the same since then. That's Nothing, crazy. He, he partied Bieber to the point that he saw Jesus. Like he wanted to go to the Lord. He didn't want no more parties. No more dirty parties for him. Yeah, that kid, that kid, now nah, he's a man, but that kid freaking went through so much stuff that that he's he's done. He's gonna I don't think he's gonna be exactly, but he's gonna be like this uh this kid uh oh no, he got scars. He, Orlando, what that's his name, Orlando Brown. What that's his name, right? The kid oh, that no. that Orlando Brown, they they that guy is He's on another another world. He's gone, man. He's, He's gone, gone, gone. I don't know man. if you've seen that video that he they got of him in the party. And it looks like the guy is carrying him through the whole video, trying to make him like come out of whatever high he did. It was hilarious. It was like he was forced there or something. He had the only forced look. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. Well, Diddy is done. Diddy's done because he's gonna be doing like a good twenty-five and better. Well, if he's lucky, him, fifteen. If it's bullshit, it's fifteen. Because he's lucky if he make it to see a month or a week in that. Yeah, as many people he done dirty in the world, bro. Especially a lot of artists and a lot of artists from the streets, bro. They gotta put him somewhere very, very protective. They ain't gonna make it in there. Yeah, he's done. Especially if they take his money and he can't pay for no protection and man like that. You're done. You're a regular joint in there. Yeah. But you used to getting taken, taking that, taking that, taking that. So you are. Well, well, folks, I've been uh for years hoping for this because I never liked the Diddy. Never freaking damn followed him. Same thing as Jay Z. I'm waiting for Jay Z to be the next one, but Diddy's done. And, and it's just like the thing is like Diddy goes. He's just like a foot soldier to like the mm-hmm. other people that's doing some more crazier stuff too. It's like a, a a stepping stool. Diddy's like a little stepping stool. I would like to see Jay Z and all these other people that we know got some dirt on them too, and that needs to come to light. Yeah, that's gonna take his time though. Oh yeah, but you already know they catch Diddy. He might start talking. Oh yeah, man. But 
99.9% of the time, they don't make it to talk. So I don't think he's going to make it to talk. If he don't start talking now, he ain't going to make it to talking. Yeah, he's done. He's done. <laughs>